to the fact that hundreds of thousands of kids are bullied every single day across America. Joining me now with more information on how we can help our kids to combat bullying is author and mindset consultant Stan Pearson. Stan, so happy you're here. Thank you. So great to be here. Uh, such an important topic, and I, I was picking his brain in the, in the commercial, <laughs> as you guys could probably tell, because, you know, it's such a tricky time. And I, I think when you're making your points, we, we want to talk about kind of getting us back to an era of uh, pre-social media kindness sure. and and one of your most important points about bullying is building our children's confidence why do you say that's so important right that's important because we usually do things for one of two reasons how we feel about ourselves and how we think other people view us so it's really important to understand how we feel about us so we're not allowing others to project their feelings on us and then haunt ourselves with things that we aren't willing to deal with yet. So just knowing who you are and being comfortable in that skin yeah. is confidence. Yeah, so, so important. And do I even want to know the stats of bullying? Oh, I'm goodness. afraid to know. So roughly, you know, 30% of kids, let's say, admit to bullying. So that's actually admit to it. And roughly 70% of, of people of teens witness it, you know, actually, again, admit to witnessing it or seeing it. So that creates trauma for anyone involved. Absolutely. And what are the reasons that people bully? You know, one of two reasons, right? Oftentimes it may be a, a lack of confidence, a, a false confidence or uh, an inflated ego. And what that means is I'm not as good as I think I am, but I want you to think I'm better than I am. And that creates some animosity from within. And it's also like the, the less confidence, not feeling as good as you'd like to feel and projecting that. And if you feel small about something, you might think other people see that in you as well. When they may when not. When they may not, exactly. Absolutely. Okay, and you have tips to help us boost our kids' confidence. Uh, the first one is five to ten minutes of exercise. I cannot agree with this more. Oh, yeah, and people have to realize, like, no, I don't want to get up five to ten minutes early. You have to realize what's more important, that five to ten minutes early to get your body and your mind going or five to ten minutes of sleep that's going to pass anyway. Anyway, yeah. right. You wake up your life, you wake up your mind, whether it's walking around the neighborhood, around the house, or walking in step, you know, face to face with your team, your parent, with the rest of your family to yes. get the day started. Yes, absolutely. And this next one, I believe in so much positive affirmations. Heck yeah. You know, getting in the habit of every single day, I, I did a poll myself with thousands of students, and it's roughly 80% of students don't write something positive down, let alone something positive about themselves. Themselves. So who are you trying to be from day to day? I'd right. love to be great today. I, I want to be better today. Just writing something simple like that. And parents can help that out by saying, you are going to be great today. Yes. So they get in, the, in a common practice of, okay, this person sees great in me. The person that I admire the most, I can see great in me. Yes, that reinforcing that. Your next point, uh, something we talk about all the time on the show, I'm not putting it into practice just yet. Why is meditation so important? Right. Meditation is important because it allows one to be at peace with yourself. A lot of people look for happiness, but you can't have happiness without peace. Yes. So that means taking, heck, 15 seconds, 30 seconds is better than no seconds Nothing. of quiet time, of being at rest with yourself. And some people say morning time is best to meditate. Yeah. Uh, that's a great practice. Also, evening is, is great. At nighttime, my form of meditation is as I'm falling asleep, I will recite, I will recite peace, love, health, wealth, happiness. I'll recite peace, love, health, wealth, happiness over and over again. Next thing I know, I'm waking up in the morning well rested. Why? Because there's nothing stressful associated with those things that I want for myself, yes. my family, and those I come in contact with. I'm so relaxed right now just being around you. Oh, this is so you. good. I'm going to do it. I've got to start it. Yes. Um, okay, uh, on this I like. Schedule grievances, announcements, and accomplishments. I just talked to Jim awesome. that we have got to start having more of that family meeting on a weekly basis. For sure, and it's nothing that you dread. Think about this. How you do one thing is how you do everything. So if once a week on Monday, it's like, all right, we got our announcements, we got our, our grievances, we have our accomplishments. So you can talk about it at home. If you're more comfortable talking at home, you're going to be more comfortable talking at school and using that voice. Like I have a one-year-old son. They told me when he, was, when he was two months old, he'll start making noises. Bah, 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 right? They'd like make the noises back with him, empower that voice. But somehow when we get older, we're not as encouraged to use that voice which was one of the first gifts we were ever given. Yes. So again, finding out how to communicate better around the home. Yes, absolutely. And then uh, this is create 
your morning motivational cocktail that is not a mimosa, I'm assuming. No, 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 especially <laughs> those of you who are underage. Yes, right. right. It's your MMC, that is key to ultimate success because what you want to do is uh, listen to five to ten minutes of motivational content via YouTube, Netflix, whatever it is, because there's plenty of content out there. Mm -hmm. Aside from that, you also want to make sure that on your way to school, you're listening to, let's say, a positive podcast, it supports yeah. your interest, or also an audio book. I mean, listening to those things to make sure that you're set by the time your day actually starts. Yes, Hold, uh, Haley, darn it, I hate that we have to wrap. Um, and of course, tips and advice we can find on your website, mentalflightschool.com. Yes. You promise you'll come back. This was such good information. I look forward to it. Thank you so very much for having me. So, You're so appreciate it. And we hope that this has been helpful for you to start those conversations and end bullying. Little bullies become big bullies, they and we don't do. want any of it. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me.